imagine a colossal gathering, played by an unending number of stars, planets, and moons, all performing together superbly. In any case, there is one explicit fragment of this orchestra that has surprised space specialists for a seriously prolonged stretch of time. Exoplanets are natural planets that exist outside our planetary system, hidden away somewhere deep in the Milky Way. You might be astonished to find that among the colossal number of cosmic objects, there are exoplanets so like Earth so tantalizingly comparable, yet puzzling that they might be our planet's heavenly twin. We now dive into the fascinating realm of Proxima Centauri b, or Proxima b, found just 4.2 light-years away, which the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, is revolutionizing in our quest to understand. These are the divine secrets of a universe of possibilities. Imagine a moment when your mind ventures across the enormous astronomical expanse of our galaxy, the Milky Way, which is home to more than a quadrillion exoplanets. That's a number with 15 zeros. To put this into perspective, if each of these exoplanets were the size of a grain of sand, we wouldn't simply fill the Grand Canyon, we would have enough to create another landmark on Earth, a uh, Grand Canyon 2.0, stretching for a huge distance. It's equally surprising that around 20% of these grand bodies have been classified as Earth-like in terms of geology and atmosphere. That means there is a 1 in 5 chance of finding a twin of our planet. And the story doesn't end there. Alongside these planets, there could be another quadrillion moons rocky satellites like our own gravitationally bound to their parent planets. Now that we have laid out the scale, it's time to introduce the master artist prepared to paint in the intricate details, the James Webb Space Telescope. This heavenly Sherlock Holmes, with its enormous primary mirror and flexible instruments, surpasses even the most advanced optical technology. We're not talking about just any lens, its 6.5-meter primary mirror is 2.7 times larger than Hubble's. Imagine the detail it can capture in the faintest glimmer of a star billions of light-years away, and then use that data to examine the planets that orbit it. What makes JWST revolutionary isn't just its raw power, but also its cutting-edge technology, including advanced sensors and spectrographs. These devices can do far more than simply observe. They can analyze the light emitted, absorbed, or reflected by celestial objects to determine atmospheric composition, temperature, density, and even mass. Acting as a cosmic detective, JWST can reveal whether a planet contains water, organic molecules, or oxygen vital clues in the search for life. This elevates JWST from a mere observer to a scientific genius. It's not just an improvement over Hubble, it's a quantum leap. If Hubble's discoveries amazed us, JWST is prepared to dazzle, particularly with its investigation of Proxima b, our closest Earth-like neighbor. Since its discovery in 2016, this intriguing planet has stood out as a Shakespearean figure complex, mysterious, and captivating scientists and dreamers alike. First of all, Proxima b is in our galactic neighborhood, just 4.2 light-years away. To put that into perspective, if you could travel at the speed of light, you would arrive in a little over four years about the same time it takes for your favorite show to go from being new to nostalgic. Considering that the universe spans over 93 billion light-years from one end to the other, finding such a promising world so close is like discovering a gem in a mountain-sized haystack a gem that might hold secrets about life itself. Proxima b sits in the habitable zone of its star, where conditions are just right for liquid water to exist. Imagine cascades, streams, lakes, and perhaps oceans as deep and mysterious as the Mariana Trench. A day on Proxima b lasts just 11 Earth days. Sunrises unfold slowly, lingering for hours before yielding to equally prolonged sunsets. While picturesque, this would have profound effects on climate and biological rhythms. Would humans need to adjust our eating patterns? Sleep differently such make Proxima be both tantalizingly familiar and frustratingly alien a riddle wrapped in a riddle. The James Webb Space Telescope operates like a cosmic Swiss army knife more than just a telescope, it's a laboratory in space. Using spectrographs, JWST can study the light from exoplanets, revealing their atmospheric components and potential biosignatures. It's a form of space forensics, allowing scientists to make confident predictions about a planet's habitability without ever visiting. Then, just when the story seemed to reach its climax, researchers using JWST detected something extraordinary from Proxima b, an unusual electromagnetic signal complex, structured and possibly artificial. For a moment, humanity held its breath. Could this be the long-awaited sign that we are not alone and just as quickly, the signal vanished, never repeating? Was it a fluke of cosmic alignment, 
or a deliberate message. The mystery remains, fueling intense debate. Harvard researchers have now proposed using JWST to search for artificial lights on exoplanets the glow of possible alien cities in the dark. Imagine spotting a cluster of lights shining across interstellar distances, hinting at a civilization thriving beneath alien skies. The search for life has expanded beyond just Proxima b into the wider galaxy. Technological leaps in astronomy, spectroscopy, and AI-driven data analysis are narrowing the list of promising worlds. With each new discovery, the definition of habitable broadens. Impossible on planets with extreme radiation, toxic seas, or crushing atmospheric pressure, Earth, extremophiles thrive in boiling acid pools, deep sea vents, and frozen wastelands, proving that life is far more adaptable than we once imagined. As humanity pushes deeper into space, we may find biosignatures, or even technosignatures faint traces of alien technology. A confirmed detection would be one of the most transformative moments in history, forcing us to reconsider our place in the cosmos. The James Webb Space Telescope has opened the curtain on a new era. The stage is vast, the actors are many, and the story has only just begun. We stand at the threshold of an age when the boundaries between science fiction and scientific reality blur. Each new image, each spectrum of light captured by JWST, peels back another layer of the cosmic veil. Somewhere out there, perhaps around Proxima b, or in the orbit of an even more distant sun might be a signal, a structure, or a shadow in the light that will change everything we know. The grow bolder, if alien civilizations exist, are they watching us as we search for them, are we the newcomers in a galaxy already teeming with life? Or is the silence we hear a sign that civilizations rise and fall long before they can reach one another, their voices extinguished in the endless night? These are not idle musings, they are the driving force behind the tireless work of scientists, engineers, and dreamers across the globe. The James Webb Space Telescope is more than a tool, it is a beacon of human curiosity, reaching across light years to touch the unknown. Every photon it captures is ancient light that began its journey before humans even walked the Earth. In those photons may lie the fingerprints of other worlds, other oceans, other skies. And perhaps, if we are fortunate, the echo of other minds. The next decade promises discoveries that could rival the greatest moments in human history. We may find alien microbes clinging to life beneath the ice of an exoplanet moon. We may detect vast atmospheric changes that suggest the presence of industry. Or, one night, we may catch a repeating signal a cosmic hello across the gulf of space. Until then, the work continues. Proxima b remains a tantalizing mystery, and JWST's gaze stretches further still toward the edge of the observable universe, where the first galaxies formed and where the earliest whispers of life may have begun. The universe is vast, and our search is just beginning. But as long as there are questions in our hearts and stars in our skies, we will keep looking. Because the ultimate truth may not be whether we are alone, but what it means to be part of a universe where life, in all its forms, can exist at all.